You see the flowers here, some plants are here. It was the same in the 1400s in the Inca time. The Incas had here orchids. One of the orchids we have here, like in a bamboo shape, can you see? With a long leaves. This one. This is the Sobralius dicotomas, one of the nice orchids that we have here. But just in the rainy season are, are blooming. Okay, we're in a dry season now. This is purple color, the flowers. How many varieties of orchids we have just in Machu Picchu? 380. Only here in Machu Picchu. 380. We have different flowers, begonias, chirimoya. You know about chirimoya? Castor apple. Sons, no? This is Chirimoya, it's growing here. What about passion fruit? Oh, yeah. Did you try passion fruit? Mm -hmm. Why do we call passion fruit? I saw it. Of course, after to eat, you, you aren't going to be passionate. Of course, eh? no. Talking about the flower, very special flower, related to the passion of Christ. This is the name Comfort. Passion fruit. Can you see this vine? Here? You will see some passion fruit. Up there we have this is a kind of orange color. Up here. This is the passion fruit. This tree is the umbrella tree. Native tree from here. Do you want to see the coca bush? Yeah. I will show you the coca bush. Over here. This is the, can you see this piece of the stone? The coca bush is here. Can you see the small bush right here? Mm -hmm. This is the tiny leaves of the yeah, coca. Why? Because the real habitat of the coca bushes are 600 feet. How high we are here? 7,854 feet high. Plus 2 inches. <laughs> this is the altitude of Machu Picchu. This is the coca bush. 100 varieties of coca leaf we have here. Three of those varieties, the shining path, or to the terrorist, they use in order to produce cocaine. By the coca leaf, is natural. If you want to produce cocaine, you need kerosene, a lot of chemicals. Okay? But it's natural, our coca. Now you know how is the bush of the coca leaf.